Here we are in London in Terry Gilliam's office. You can tell it's London because of the T. Terry was tremendously cordial, and we chatted a lot about filmmaking, comedy, and the aristocrats joke, and he told a couple of jokes of his own, and I laughed, and I told him a couple of jokes, and he laughed, and he laughed again, and told him another joke, and he laughed again, and uh, we had a great time. And he reminisced a bit about his days with Monty Python and told some funny stories. <laughs> that was a good one. Anyway, and then we talked about the aristocrats joke, and he said something interesting that he couldn't remember the details of the joke, but he remembered the image that he got. And the image that always stuck in his mind was a velvet pillow with gold braiding around the edges and tassels. That just the idea of aristocrats brought that image to him, and I, and I asked him what would be on the pillow, and he said probably a dildo, and we had a few laughs about that. And then I said to him, since everybody's doing their interpretation, as a filmmaker, what would your interpretation be? And he began to describe the opening shot of Terry Gilliam's The Aristocrats, and he said the setting is very important, and he described an agent's office, old oak with smoky windows on the doors and the partitions, and the family comes in, and they're innocent, I mean, probably from another culture, maybe Tunisia or India, and they're very innocent but they're very excited and there's nothing negative to them about what they're doing and they go through the whole act and he cuts outside to the outer office where you see the secretary peering up over the partition in horror at what she's hearing she ducks back down you see the figures moving through the glass door and bodies flying and clothes being ripped off and the agent's jaw drops and hits the ground and with a big flourish with glee and pride the family says the aristocrats that was great it was it was brilliant actually uh and we talked a little bit more about filmmaking, and he laughed and reminded me how important it is for a first-time filmmaker to always wear headphones because it's so damn easy to screw up the sound.